All right, this episode is called Two New Stars, so maybe some new accomplishments, maybe some new announcements, maybe something's going to happen. I know people are saying they're excited for this arc so much, so I got to believe you guys. What's up, Dapper Squad? It's your boy Darius back at it again with Black Clover, episode 70. This one's called Two New Stars. Uh, last episode, we had just some fun times with Charlotte, Soul, Asta, Yami, and Vanessa. Before the announcements, just kind of what you do at festivals while you wait for a certain thing. You know, while you wait for dinner, you mess around, play a couple of games, have a few competitions. You guys know the fun times. But I am excited for these announcements. This is seeming like the big highlight of this arc, so I have no idea where it's going to go. But anytime they give us more information, lore, world building with such an expansive world like this, I'm always down. So I say we stop wasting time, we jump right on into this. Remember, if you guys want early access and full length to this show and all the other shows I'm watching, we are four episodes ahead over on Patreon. Links are down below, like always. If you guys want to support me and Patreon is not really your thing, if you guys could just leave a like and a nice comment, it really does help me with that YouTube algorithm. Don't forget to subscribe, click that bell so you guys always know exactly when I post, and then follow me on all the social medias, Instagram, Twitch, and Twitter, at Dapper Darius. Don't forget, guys, we do have a P.O. Box if you guys ever want to send me anything, mail, fan mail, art, anything like that, anything and everything is much appreciated. All the info for everything is in the description like always uh let's hop right on into this black clover episode 70 two new stars let's do this the wizard king king julius is that like a little magic speaker that's so cool yeah the king the actual king if i was a Citizen of the Clover Kingdom, I'm thinking the Wizard King is way cooler than the normal king. Alright, here we go. Let's see him. Ooh, please show me the new- oh, That's the girl from the ending! That's the girl everyone keeps talking about. Nozel Silva. Jack the Ripper. A. Eh? Dorothy Unsworth, always sleeping. I haven't seen her in action, can't wait. Rill. Paint Man, my boy Painty. The new captain of the Crimson Lions, Mario Leo. How do you even say her name? Mario Miri Leona. I'm gonna. I'm definitely gonna get that. Vermilion. Wait, she's the older sister, Kaiser Granvorka. Golden Dawn. Doesn't shock me. Biggest contra. You know, got the most stars? With Sylph? Oh, Alec Dora Sandler and Langris are probably pissed. Oh, why did Langris' face look like that? I love the motivation from Asa. I saw it, it said Black Bulls. No one's even paying attention. We're in second place. All the other teams are going to be pissed about that. <laughs> Look at Gordon's face. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Medical relief to various locations, 10. Aided the Zeka region after a typhoon, fire. Border defended, yup. Magic ore and porter arrested, okay. Band of burglars, noble realm, so deal, village, frontier, magical mine, magical item, illegal substances, nobility, oh. What are you guys? We're racking them up. A hundred and one. What happens when you kick it into gear? That squad of ruffians. Yep, these are first hand witnesses, guys. First hand to what happened. You're not going to tell nobody. Oh, we got Rebecca too. Everyone who we've helped along the way is going to be here, huh? Feels good to have Julia say that. <laughs> Shit's going to make me tear up, I swear to God. My man needs some recognition after everything he's been through. <laughs> oh. 
my man's coming flying in. Ooh, right in front of her. Nice landing. You gotta do what you gotta do. Of course, with the number one member of the Golden Dawn. Rising newcomer star from the Black Bulls. Ooh. Come on, man. <laughs> Love the rivalry. <laughs> He's actually challenging him with the math. <laughs> he needs some recognition. Come on, folks. Give him a round of applause. Very impressed. Oh, <laughs> I wonder what noble families. Seke, come on. There's no way you're being this much of a dick right now. Full power what? You could kill these people with full power. <laughs> you know? Yeah, just because I'm not from a rich or a noble family, it doesn't mean it gives you the right to talk shit about me. I'm ten times powerful than all of you combined. Oh my god, you know is so strong, so badass. They're gonna sh they're gonna show the people. They don't believe just because he has no magical powers and he's a peasant that he couldn't do have any made all any of these accomplishments. Look at this. He just deflected that, which said, come on, look at that. Right? Seke. Come on, Seke. You're the Dark Lord Seke. Don't talk shit. Oh my god, I guess peasants, you know, now that you think about it, they might be human too. Holy- wait, am I a human? These fucking guys. Yeah, no, shout out you guys. You guys definitely getting some recognition from the past 69 episodes that you guys fucking deserve. Nozel is pissed. Charlotte is drunk. She looks pissed too. I swear he seems younger than Asta, and I was really- is he really a captain? This man. Augustus Clearer Clover the... the 13th. Because X is 10, right? My, my Roman numerals are kind of ass. No one's cheering for him at all. I literally said it earlier. If I was a citizen, I'm like, the king's cool. <laughs> but I like the wizard king way cooler. Okay. The ultimate hand-picked unit, the special black ops, the Royal Knights. Tournament arc, baby. Okay. Tournament arc time. Oh, <laughs> Okay, okay. We finally are gonna get to see our other people in action. I've been wanting this since literally episode like four, five, when we first saw all the magic squad knight captains. So I like how they announced this whole royal knights after the announcement. So anyone who did good and wants to stay doing good, anyone who did horribly wants to prove themselves to make it on this team, you know? Always thinks of something fun. That's my boy Julius. Yes. There are still rookies. Way inexperienced. Yup. I'm just saying, we're gonna see some crazy shit. Tougher than you've ever seen. I'm ready. Be up for the task. Go forward. 
Now I'm getting full of yourselves. Thank you, sir. Are we gonna get like a training sesh? Is that my boy Leopold? Yeah, I did say she looked pissed that she got fifth. They even play like a lion sound when she talks. Okay, Mar 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 Mariliona. Marili oh, it's so hard to say her name. So I'm assuming they don't pronounce the O too heavy in her name. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie. I looked up a video of someone saying her name. Not no spoilers or anything, just to say how they said her name. They said Mariliona. So if that sounds decent or okay with you guys, is that because that's way easier to say than Miro Mariliona. So just Mariliona. Does that sound right? Cause I, you guys know me, I, I'm really trying to be on top of it when it comes to getting names down. But uh, that was so lit of an episode. Very excited for this next arc and where they're building up to. We have an exam that is going to form the Royal Knights, which are just going to be the best handpicked of all of them. So like the squad, the unit, you know, the Sasuke retrieval arc squad. And I'm just joking, but I am just so excited to figure out not to figure out but to, to see their powers abilities uh expertise strategies when it comes to fighting the magic styles because it's so differentiating between people and then just more spells and magic you know like uh mary leona she seems super strong she just socked leopold in the face right there she's the older sister that's a big thing for me because if she was the middle child between leopold and and Fuegoleon, She's the older sister, so I'm curious uh, about a little bit of her backstory, why we haven't seen her, what's been going on with her, why she's just now getting on the uh, Crimson Lions, even though, even though, you know, they've been the Crimson Lions for the longest. What happened before? Was she on there and left? And then that's when Fogolian took, took over? I'm, I'm curious. I need to know more info. We also have Kaiser as the new leader of the Purple Orcas. I'm curious to see him in action as well. Like I said, I'm curious to see all of them in action. Uh, I loved uh, Julius and how charming he was this episode and how everyone was shocked that the Black Bulls were number two and how amazing that is. That was such a good reveal. And how Asta and Yuno both got some recognition they rightfully deserved. Felt great, it felt great. So I gotta say, I think I might have a little binge sesh with these next few episodes and get into this arc because I am excited. Hopefully you guys are as well. If you did enjoy this, please leave a like. Let me know your thoughts. Um, if you guys don't want to wait for the next bunch of episodes, want to watch them early, check out that Patreon. Other than that, Dapper Squad, thank you guys. Have a great day, y'all.